now I'm inspired to win big. Too bad all I have is $100. Let's just see how far it'll get me here and let it ride. In the meantime, if you want to get serious about poker, you've got to learn how to play without tipping your hand. I'm in for 100. 100. Call. I call. All right, Brian. What were my tells? Was I a fish? Did I give it all away? Your body posture changed when you had a hand. The way you fiddled your chips, your sunglasses, the way you looked at the other player. What do you mean my body posture changed, Brian? <laughs> so, Brian, you've been a professional poker dealer for what, four years now? Four years now. So you must have seen a lot of behaviors in people that give away their hand. I guess they're called tells, like when I was bracing my body. What's the number one thing? People tend to touch their nose quite often if they have a hand or they become a little bit nervous. Like an itchy nose? It, absolutely, itchy nose, rubbing their nose a little bit. What about the chips, though? I mean, I see a lot of people kind of like juggling their chips. Is that a giveaway, It's more of a too? show thing. They like to shuffle the chips. It takes away from the nervousness of it all. It's a distraction to them. People tend to shuffle the cards sometimes. They're not too sure whether they should let them go or not, or hold on to them, so they shuffle them between their hands. Oh, you mean, or they keep looking at them over and over again? Exactly. Kind of like I was doing. A little bit. <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> all right, what else? Um, some people tend to crack their knuckles. Like, to go back and forth between their hands, maybe reach behind their back a little bit, but definitely with their knuckles or they press them down on the tables. And what about when people say like, oh man, I got a great hand. Do people ever, are they ever that overt when they're trying to bluff? Some people are very melodramatic about it. I got a monster. And you said I had a very stiff body. I mean, does that mean like I was being aggressive? Did you think that meant I was trying to bluff or that you, I was being real? You wanted to show maybe a little bit of sign of intimidation. Some people tend to do it with their body posture. And the sunglasses. You know, I see some people in the World Series of Poker Tournament, they're wearing glasses. Are they trying to give away, like, uh, you know, not show people that their eyes are darting around? Well, they don't want to look around if there's other players involved in the hand, so they act like they're focusing on one thing, although they may be looking at other players' body postures to see if they're giving the tell at the same time. I've seen people too, though, and I don't know if this is because they've been drinking too much in the casino or not, but their <laughs> hands shake a lot when they Absolutely. play. Absolutely. People tend to get a little bit nervous, and you'll see the way they touch their chips, even if they're going to grab to make a bet, they'll fumble the chips at the same time. So if you were going to tell me what to work on, what tells would you tell me I need to improve? Consistency. Keeping your body posture the same. Always do the same things, even if you don't have a hand. Therefore, people won't know when you do have a hand. Where's Dave? I want to play him again. Hey, Dave. You ready to go another hand? Anytime. 